grain giants and bias. There are two main ideas. We will see which countries not only produce enough grain for domestic consumption, but also supply food to the world market for many years. And we will see what kind of grain is preferred in different countries. Wheat, corn, rice, barley are the main crops that countries trade with each other. A small share in oats and rye. On the chart you can see the market shares of each cereal at the end of the 2010s. Let's learn how to read these cartograms using the wheat map as an example. If the entire world wheat market is 100%, then in 1986, the year of my birth, the main suppliers are Canada, USA, France, Australia, Argentina. The main buyers of wheat, Italy, more than 11% of all deliveries. The Soviet Union, 20%, Japan, 9%. China 8%, Iran, Iraq 3 and 2%. If we zoom in on the map, we will see that Belgium and the Netherlands are the same in 1986. Now let's start the counter of years. We will see how the positions of the countries on the sale and purchase of the wheat changed. From year to year the main sellers, USA, Canada, France, they are always painted over the bright blue. China, USSR, until the early 19th, were traditional buyers of wheat. At the end of the 2010s, we see the main suppliers are now USA 18%, Canada, France, Russia 17%, Ukraine 10%, Australia, Argentina. Buyers in Europe, Turkey, the Netherlands, Spain, in Africa, Egypt, Algeria, Nigeria, Morocco. Brazil is a big buyer and in Asia, Japan, China and Indonesia. Now let's look at corn. Among the buyers of corn are noticeable Japan, Soviet Union, South Korea, Mexico, Brazil, Venezuela, Peru, Cuba, in Africa, Algeria, Egypt, Kenya, in Europe, Spain, Germany, Great Britain, Italy, Turkey. Among suppliers at the end of 2010s, USA 25%, Brazil 22%, Argentina 18%, Ukraine 16%. The next cartogram is about rice. Exporting countries in the 70s, 80s, USA, China, Thailand, Pakistan, importing countries, Indonesia, Saudi Arabia, Nigeria, other countries of Africa and South America. In the 21st century, India, Thailand, Vietnam, Pakistan, United States sell rice. And China, the Arab countries and Philippines are big buyers.
The next grain crop that countries actively trade with each other is barley. It can be seen the main buyers at the end of 20th century. USSR, Saudi Arabia. The main suppliers are Canada, France. In the 19th Australia was a major supplier and China was a buyer. In the 2000s, Ukraine and Russia joined the suppliers and Saudi Arabia purchases in some years more than 40% of the entire barley market. A separate product category is bakery products. Here special attention is paid to Europe, where the main suppliers of flour products are Holland, Belgium, Germany, Italy. Main buyers Great Britain, France and the share of the USA at the end of 2010s is more than 20%. I look forward to your comments and feedback. Write uh, what products uh, you are interested in learning about first of all. My name is Nikolai Pameshenko. Goodbye.